guys. I have a cool announcement for you. I have this partnership with Trafalgar Square Books. Um, and they sent me this book here, The Art of Liberty Training for Horses by Jonathan Field. Um, if you want to get yourself a copy, you can go to trafalgarsquarebooks.com or horseandriderbooks.com, which I will link to below in the description. And you'll get 20% off of your order if you use the code BARNRAT. And, um, yeah, so I'm just super interested in learning all about natural horsemanship. I don't know a whole lot about it. Um, it's not like it almost feels like its own thing even though I know I know that it's not I know that natural horsemanship isn't like its own discipline but sometimes it feels like it's not the way or not traditional for the hunter jumper world so I don't really care about that I'm interested in learning new things and I will be using this book as a as my guide it's gonna teach me and we're gonna see what happens because I have a very limited knowledge in natural horseman training techniques. I took a clinic probably a year ago um, and it was interesting and I've done the exercises with my horses a little bit and seen them improve just by doing the exercises and noticed that they became maybe just a little bit like they would stand still a little better on the cross ties or they become more responsive to my leg under saddle so that's kind of where I would like to see what kind of other changes I can make by doing these exercises so I will be using this book to teach me how to be a natural horseman so yeah so I plan on mainly using my horse Val um, he is an eight-year-old thoroughbred who still sometimes gets a little pushy and doesn't really have the best ground manners um, they're not awful and um, I'm interested in really just seeing how the natural horsemanship exercises can influence a horse like what kind of changes they'll make um, because I'm not really in a situation where uh, this is like, I don't know, one of those last ditch efforts to try and get a horse to be useful or anything like that. I just am super curious as to where this could take us and take me as a trainer and seeing what kind of little things I can pick up on and what a horse is trying to tell me. Um, and I'll probably be using, yeah, Val for the most part, but then I also would love to do these things with my older horse, Cheeks, um, and just any horse, we have a lot of horses available at the barn that I might be using, so we'll see how this goes, and maybe I'll be branching out and using lots of different horses to practice these skills.
Okay. Oh, looking cute is not a thing.